Welcome back to Blazing Tech. We got another video for you guys. We have one. Today's video is mainly about how to fix the FPS lag, CPU high usage, and video and audio latency. This settings will actually work for Mac and Windows, but you might have a difference. I will explain the differences that you won't that you won't have. So let's get down straight to it. Okay, first we're gonna actually have OBS open. We're going to click on settings. We'll go ahead and cl click on advance. In advanced mode, we actually here we set up the process priority, but on Mac, you will not have it. It's right above uh, the video. We'll go ahead and go to video now. And here you make sure you select the uh, base canvas resolution that is set to your computer's resolution. This computer will not support 2560 by 1440 at this point in time. It's an older computer. And so I set, set it up to uh, 1920 by 1080 and it works real, real smooth. So make sure you set the, also you set, we set the downscale filter to bilinear to get the best performance. So we'll actually go to output next and we make sure we click, make sure it advances. It's checked again. We check our rate control, make sure CBR constant bit rate. CBR is actually selected. Make sure we set our bit rate to 5,000. YouTube's base is 4,500. Uh, you can increase it or decrease it, but YouTube might tell you to increase it or decrease it just depending on what kind of stream and what your, your settings are located at. And for our settings, we're actually setting at 5,000. Um, I've actually had set to 4,000, 4,500 before, and it does work perfectly fine. Uh, but if you might need to upgrade five, I have it higher because I could get at least so I don't have any issues and it seems to be working fine. The keyframe I would actually set to two seconds and also make sure you set your your tune to zero latency or latency, whatever you call it. You could also do the same settings here into the recordings. You change that to custom output. You could change all this right here settings to the exact same thing as I did on the output. Also too, I had some recently issues that I had audio and video not syncing. My, my audio would be coming out first and then my video would come out next. I got a fix for that. So the way you fix that issue is actually you select your microphone, you go to audio advanced properties, you click on that and then you look for your mic. Your mic, once you set that up, for me, it actually works at 550 and I've tested this and it works. If I'm using like, if I use direct from my computer to the web, it works perfectly fine. But if I'm using Zoom, Skype, or Discord, or any third-party application, there's going to be a delay on audio and video. The fix is changing your sync offset to 550. It might be a little bit lower, a little bit higher. I would suggest you check that and do some private, private, um, or so I say unlisted test videos and test the syncing. But for me, the video has tested 550. I've seen people, a couple of videos do 300, but... For my occasion, it didn't work at, at 300, in the 300s. It might work at a 500, so I would recommend try it higher. My audio was like two seconds, two to three seconds off, and I got this at 550, and it worked. It, it man managed to sync it just perfect. So that is my settings for OBS, and it, man it actually works. So that's going to wrap up this video, guys. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so you won't miss any more videos. If you want to, if you want to actually see more of this type of content, please comment down below what you program or app or anything you want to see on this channel. We will look into it and see if we could further help you on on any issues you're having because we're a tech channel. We would love to help you guys out on products and stuff that you want to you probably want to see and us for us to test. So, hope you enjoyed this content and we will see you guys on the next video.